Hello, I'm playing Terraria on my on my boys club's first ever video. We are going to make we are going to be playing Terraria. Terraria is a 2D game similar to Minecraft. I love it because it has good weapons, it has fun pets, it has fishing rods where you can fish, you can get gold crates, you can get mounts that you can ride on and that's really that's the good things that you can do. So I'm going to show you how to make a world and character. So as you can see I have a couple of characters and I'm going to make another one. Create character. I'm going to go female, skin colour a palish um uh, yeah kind of like um, what shows the kind of like ill I think that does and now I'm going to put this hair hair colour I think I'm going to go like kind of lightish blonde yeah eye colour let's go let's go this and let's um that ooh that's new um so this is front shirt colour I'm gonna go let's go red Let's go, um, black for top. Trousers, red. Shoes, black. Create. I'm going to go hate. our game. Now I'm going to make another world. Normal world. Zoom. Now this is just why it creates it takes longer for normal worlds, but it's worth the waiting for no for big worlds, cause it it really does make a difference. Cause there's so many bio biomes, you get double biomes and stuff. You get ice biomes, a double biome, so you get like two um two corruption or two crimson biomes, which are biomes that are. Ooh, that was a high jump. Their new update. Oh. So you start off with wooden swords, new recipe, and all. Oh. oh, mushrooms. What can I make? Ooh. Let's get some wood, I think. This is an axe, use them to chop trees and this is a pickaxe which you use for mining blocks. Some more wood. How many slimes about? Ooh. Oh, yeah. This is um, a desert biome sword ready at any time oh I think this is a, one of those temple places where you have things ooh some money this is always good
now, so I'm just opening the money bag. Let's look in the chest. So now I'm in. I've looked through that chest, and normally, if you look down here, you should see another room. So mine down there with whatever pickaxe you have. You'll start off with a let's see what copper pickaxe, copper axe, wooden sword. And um, you see those bags down in the corner? Those are um, money bags, and depending on what colour, the copper looking ones are copper money, but you get like. And the um, uh, silver ones are silver coins, and the gold ones are gold coins. Gold coin ones are the best, except for platinum ones, which can be mistaken for. which are really rare, but can be mistaken sometimes for with um, uh, with silver ones because they look so similar So um, again, I'm gonna move around. So I'm mining into here, mine down, and um, those bags are things. The pots have and um, stuff in them as well. Different biomes have their own type of pots. Pots. So sometimes they can they can look like eyes in the crimson. Sometimes they look a bit weird. And sometimes, um, like here, they look like Pharaoh Egyptian ones. So now I'm going to go home. From in here I got this thing that sends you home in the chest that we first got. So all you have to do is use it and it sends you back home. Let's what, see what money I got. 13 gold coins, 60 gold, 50. 56 silver that's actually really good because because that money money is really good later on in the game when so I would save it up because from people you get from building houses um are really good now I'm gonna build over to over here because I saw something that is really useful down here not the ore, but that can be useful for armour, but something that is permanently useful. I'm playing Terraria, and Terraria is a game where you make, where you try and defeat bosses, make items with armour and, and stuff. As you can see, from where I'm about to go, you can get this weapon called the Water Bolt which shoots beams of water using your mana stars. You start off with one of these and use five fallen stars to make them. You, ten is the maximum. I have to shot them and if there's anything up there, they should bounce. Any gonna bounce? Oh, okay, let's just kill this guy because he's gonna shoot me. No, non-bounced. Guess there's no floating island up there. That's a way to find floating islands or you can use gravitation potions which are kind of like um, things that uh, that make you able to fly Bradley would like to settle down ooh what's this oh your bed is obstructed oh yeah because it's not in a proper good housing oh that must be his bed so this is the guy that at night if I let me talk to him. Oh, it's not night yet, technically. So I would summon Skeletron, but this is a boss. This is the, I'd say, the third boss you would go for. Second is like, is a drawed place for with Brain of Cthulhu and the other guy, which is called, um, uh, which is called the, um, Eater of Souls, which is a big giant worm, kind of and it 
which is absolutely massive. And the first one I'll go for is I have Cthulhu. So I'm going to fight Skeletron. Thanks for watching. Hope you come back for watching some more next time.